I know a lot of people with like bizarre jobs, but the guy I know with the most bizarre job of all is a friend of mine, Britt Eaton. Britt describes himself as a denim detective. As he scrounges around old ghost towns and down mining shafts and abandoned homesteads and abandoned ranches in search of old workwear from the late 1800s and early 1900s. If someone's gonna find an old pair of jeans, they're gonna come out of a ghost town or mine shaft or someplace. So today I'm gonna hang out with him in an old ghost town and we're gonna try our luck and see what we can find. I saw some old homestead cabins down here. I can't leave any stone unturned. I have to check it out. It's like an addiction, you know, I gotta see everything. A pair of Levi's 501s today is extremely similar to the cut and the fit of a pair 150 years ago. Now this place is pretty damn old. When were dudes hanging out here? The people lived here starting about 1875, the mines closed in 1901, and then pretty much everybody was gone by 1908. In your life, how many of these buildings have you been through, you think? I've been in more old buildings than anyone in the world. I, I, would, I would say half a million, you know? I mean, I spent 12 years doing this full time. But now, so people might have stuffed their clothes up. Oh, here's some. Jesus, don't touch it, wait, wait. That's a pair of jeans. It really, really is a pair of jeans, I can't believe it. <laughs> Don't touch it though. It needs to be extracted carefully. It's obviously been wet. We're sitting on snow. It's who knows how long it's been there. It might've fallen out of the wall here a year ago or 70 years ago. Yeah. I don't know. A lot of times when you start picking it up, they just kind of fall apart. It's like fragile paper. I'm afraid it might just be a scrap guys, but something's better than nothing, right? I mean, even a leg like this might be worth a hundred bucks, but this is a very early pant. This is definitely 1800s pant. You ever get to wondering like what this guy did? Well, the irony here is these people were miners, right? They wore jeans while they were looking for gold, but the <laughs> pants that they're wearing is my gold. Now I know those logs, I mean, just, even though everything's falling down, the logs are still like pretty good shape. I mean, they, they built this to last a hundred years. It has lasted a hundred years and probably would last another hundred years if somebody would take care of it. Sure beats working in an office. It does, man.